Google Sheets is a great Excel alternative, boasting a massive amount of functionality while hosted entirely in the cloud. The two spreadsheet applications share a lot of similarities, so if you're familiar with Excel, transitioning to Google Sheets is surprisingly easy. If you're trying to perform one of the most essential aspects of any spreadsheet tool, subtraction, you've come to the right guide. By far, the simplest way to subtract is by using the formula bar. Just as you would in Excel, click on a cell, type what you want to subtract in the formula bar, and the cell will now show the value of that equation. Google Sheets also has a minus function with a syntax of minus value one comma value two. In this case, value one is the menu end and value two is the subter end. You can either type out the numbers as value one and value two or type out the numbers cell coordinates. This function, however, is limited to just two values. If you're looking to subtract formulas using a wider range of cells, using subtraction formulas is the way to go. As an example, let's enter 250 in B3 and 200 in B4. Subtract the values in those cells by selecting an empty cell and entering equals B3 minus B4. The selected empty cell will now display the difference between B3 and B4, which is 50. There are a few other tricks to subtracting in Google Sheets. For example, if you want to subtract a date, just enter the dates in mm slash dd slash yyyy format and use the subtraction formula as you will. You can also subtract cell range totals by incorporating the sum function within the subtraction formula, eliminating the need to add separate sum functions to a couple of cells before subtracting the total. For example, let's enter 50 in E3, 150 in E4, 50 in F3, and 125 in F4. Select an empty cell, then enter sum parentheses E3 colon E4 close parentheses minus sum parentheses F3 colon F4 close parentheses. The selected empty cell will now display the difference between E3 and E4's sum and F3 and F4's sum, which is 25. This isn't just limited to cell ranges, it also works when you add numerical values to that formula. You can, of course, add as many numbers as you want. You may also subtract values in multiple worksheets by including sheet references. As an example, create a second spreadsheet, then enter 100 in sheet 1's B10 cell and enter 50 in sheet 2's B10 cell. Now select an empty cell and enter equals sheet 1 exclamation point B10 minus sheet 2 exclamation point B10. This will display the difference between 100 and 50 in the cell you selected. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Sheets and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.